What's up guys? Um, so yesterday I did a best of three with Monkey Lord. Um, wait, 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 where have the... Where have they gone? No! One, two... Oh my god, they've gone? Okay, we're gonna have to su search up Monkey Lord then. Right, okay. I think... I think he's called that, if we search for him. Right, okay, we find him. Right, so, we'll go with the um, first game we played, which was on Offside. Um, I'm sorry about the timer. Uh, I honestly don't know how to get rid of it with my editing uh, with Windows Movie Maker, so you're going to have to bear with. I'm sorry if it spoils it for you. Uh, leave a dislike if it did. Um, but anyway, let's get right into this. So I'm going to speed the first bit up. Um, so yeah, check out Monkey Lord's YT channel. You've probably already seen it. I'll put the link in the description and the comments section. Right, so this is where it gets interesting. Uh, he sends reds layered with blues, um, but I just send blues. Now, I'm not sure which rush is more effective. Uh, I've, like, we've both got, well, actually, I've got less money than him, uh, but I've only got one more eco. So I think what he did was slightly better layering a few reds with a few blues rather than just going, like, five sets of blues, I think. But anyway, our Dark Monkey spots are pretty much the same. Uh, we're the same in farms. He manages to get... Look, look, I, I was one off there of getting a farm. So I get my farm slightly later. And he gets an extra banana because of it. Uh, so right now, uh, he's ha he, he has got a little bit more money. But then he goes for a blue rush. Uh, layered with pinks. And I have one Dark Monkey. Uh, this is actually a pretty big rush. Uh, so I leak quite a few lives to it. I don't know why I didn't use my spikes. Uh, but yeah, I lose like 50 lives. More than 50 lives. Uh, just because I didn't get that up to triple darts. And I don't pressure him back, which is definitely a mistake. So we're going to speed this up a bit. Because uh, this bit's boring. Sorry um, I did it on Battles TV. I just I was playing on my phone instead of the computer. So we both sent blacks. Uh, he's, he layers it with pink, so I just sent blacks. Normal blacks. Um, we've both got two triple dart monkeys, so we deal with it fine, I guess. Um, I leak a few more lives. I think it's because of targeting, maybe. Uh, but at this point, I'm sl I was slightly up in farms, just slightly. And then he he goes for another black rush laid with the round seven AI, which is normally good because round seven AI is a, a little bit stronger than like all the other rounds. Uh, well, the earlier rounds. So as you can see, I leak even more. So now I'm down to half lives. Although I have more money than him, I'm, I'm not sure why I didn't go for the plantation there. Uh, but then I go for a, a pretty beefy, um, so regen whites and then some yellows on top. He gets a spike bolt up, but the regen whites, um, some of them sneak through. Uh, so now I've got about 50 lives off him, which is pretty nice. And as you can see, I've got more money because he had to buy the spike bolt and he's not selling any of his triple darts. So now I'm up in farms. Um, and then, I, I don't know why I put that down, but I put a cannon down. I guess it's because I knew the yellows were coming. Um, and then I get it up to cluster bombs. I said I get it up to cluster... Yeah, I get it up to cluster bombs finally. Um, probably didn't need to do that because the rush was ending. I sent some leads because I see he doesn't have a juggernaut. And right now, uh, actually, he, he had a lot of money there. So yeah, he goes for the juggernaut. I get my third farm, so I'm like... Um, quite a few bananas extra brown, though he does have 80 x no, 90, no, 100 more eco than me. And he goes for this, um, regen zebra rush, which, well, I have tons of triple darts, it didn't do anything, um, but yeah. So I get another farmer, I'm breeding quite a lot in this game compared to him, uh, but anyway. He puts two dart monkeys there, just to, just in case if I send a rush. He sends some camo lead, so I have to get my jug up. I just bought a farm there, so I have to sell a dart monkey um, to get the jug up. Uh, not too, and Nothing too interesting uh, right now. He's got 100 more eco. I have a few more farms. Not really much to talk about. Uh, I send some regen leads, uh, laid with pinks, and I get him to boost uh, right there. But it doesn't do much. And he sells his other two dart monkeys down there. Uh, just to carry on farming. And then, I go all out. Well, not all out, but I sent a pretty beefy uh, regen rainbow rush. And it looked like he leaked loads there. Uh, but apparently, he hardly leaked anything. Uh, so, probably a waste of money on my behalf. Now, if you look at the boosts, 
I've used up two balloon boosts, same as him, but I've got an extra tower boost, uh, which could come in use. So, um, he sends a Moab to me. Now, I've got my cannon ready to get a Moab Mauler. I get the Moab Mauler. Uh, it doesn't seem to be doing much work. And I was kind of scared that the ceramics would get past, so I boosted at the last moment. Probably didn't need to, but to be fair, I'm a boost up, so now we're equal in boost, so it doesn't really matter. Um, he's got six plantations up, same as me. And we've got the same eco now, because he sent that mob, so it hurt his eco a little bit. He's also, um, he's also dark monkey spams, just in case. Right, so. Well, almost, well... Actually, I won't say that because that would probably spoil it, but, you know, you can see it. You can see the timer. I'm sorry I couldn't get rid of it. So, it's round 20 now. Uh, so, BFB time. I send a BFB. He, surprisingly, doesn't send a BFB to me. And I was really expecting one. Uh, I thought that I'd had to sell farms. And he gets the BA, uh, the BIA out right when I send the BFB. Um, oh, man, that was so unlucky. So he, I send some leads, normal leads behind it because it gets more RBE. Um, plus, I didn't have much money at the at that point, uh, so regular leads. Well, they seem to be doing the job, distracting the dark monkeys from popping the BFB. So then he gets the uh, he gets the dark monkey ability. It, it deals with the BFB, but now he is down on farms um, because he had to sell that BIA. Uh, so that's really going to be a trouble for him. And now, I go for a, a, a pretty beefy regen rainbow rush. And he can't micro fight. He gets the Operation Dart Storm up. But sadly, it was really unlucky. It spawns. It spawns at the top. So it's going up there when the balloons are down there. So I think if it went down there first, he could have defended. Anyway, let's go on to the second game. So I win the first one. Pretty unlucky. We'll, we'll jump straight into the second one. Um, I didn't choose this map. He chose it. I don't really like steps to be honest. Uh, it's kind of it's a shortish map that I'm not really used to playing. Uh, just like you know the arena map, the new map. I'm not used to playing in it. I know it's long, but I really hate it because I've never played in it before. So again, uh, I just send the blues, and he sends the blues layered with the reds. Now, someone good in the comment section, just tell me why he does that because it's probably better because I'm leaking more lives uh, and he's got more money than me. Uh, but yeah, just tell you just tell me why. And that was better. So, uh, I'm just going to speed this up. Because uh, this bit's not really interesting. It's just farming. Placing dark monkeys down uh, for the pinks, the blues, uh, the blacks, stuff like that. We both got our farm. Uh, we both boost um, pinks. I boost just pinks. He boosts blues plus pinks. Uh, he layers it again. Though, it looks like he lost more lives than me. Um, which isn't... Wait, what? It says, it says he's got three spike piles there. But there are spikes on this track. What the hell? That's like a glitch or something, surely. Yeah, so I'm leaking quite a bit more. I probably should have placed down some more spikes. Because uh, he's gradually draining me of lots of lives. Then I send some greens layered with uh, blacks and pinks. He does the same to me. And I lose even more lives. So I'm down to 60, 66 lives. Which is quite a lot gone already. It's round 7. So yellow's on the next round, I guess. He sends another black rush, because I'm under defending, um, and I have two plantations, so I have to get another dark monkey up. Uh, but it looks like it, I'm going to leak even more. So, right now, I'm pretty low on lives. So I, I get the cannon up, just to show him I have it, uh, so I don't have to sell a farm to get the cluster bombs up. Um, he does. I notice he doesn't have much, so I'm going to send some my normal regen whites, then some yellows. He gets a spike bolt up. And he hardly leaks any lives. He just leaks one of the regen whites. Which is why I send the regen whites. Because sometimes they get through. The spike pole regenerates them. So I'm under, I'm under defending here compared to him. As you can clearly see. I'm going to speed this bit up a little bit. Um, so yeah, I'm under defending a lot. Because he, sh he should definitely send me a rush. Because I'm, I'm farming a lot more than him. So then finally, uh, we send each other some leads. Uh, so he has to get his jug up. So I have to get some extra dark monkeys to deal with that. Uh, nothing too interesting. He sent some regen zebras, which I almost died to, plus white. So I have to energy, uh, otherwise I'd die. Oh no, I don't energy, I conserve the energy. But I almost die uh, just from that, so I have to dark monkey spam. Now, if, if, if he did an all-out rush, I'd probably die right now because my micro is terrible. Uh, but he doesn't. 
He sends, he sends, um, well, well, you'll see. Um, so I'm farming more than him still, but it's been a pretty aggressive game, to be honest, with lots of rushes going around. I said, I don't even know why I sent some rainbows there, uh, because you can see, oh, it does a bit of damage. I should have gone all out, though, if I actually wanted to win. This is probably the point where if I sent an all out rush right now, he would have died. Because he, he would have to get the, uh, Operation Dark Storm up. Right, okay, so. He sent us a zebra rush. Just an average size one. But I didn't realise there were so many camos. So as you can see, the ca I, I defend everything, but I leak a few camos and I die. Right, so. It's one all. Deciding game. So this was pretty interesting. I said, I said to Monkey Lord on Discord, I want the, I want the, the ice pole map, you know, the, 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 the snowy one. And I actually meant uh, the other snowy one, uh, but I was pretty pleased I got this map, uh, because I've been working on a strat uh, that I really like, and yeah, that's why I went with that. So I was pretty happy that we got this map, even though it was the one I didn't want. So you can see here, he goes for a farm, uh, which is pretty weird. <laughs> I mean, farms on ice you can only fit one. Better to go with the eco, um, because the farm wastes a tower slot. So, he's in trouble here, because he's, he's already lost uh, 100 lives. And I'm just going to keep ecoing as much as I can. So, he gets the triple darts up to deal with the rest of the eco. Uh, but right now, I'm at, I'm at an advantage, uh, because he has one less tower slot. And he's, you can see, he goes with the sub and the ice, whereas I go for the boat for the BFBs and Moabs and stuff, uh, the ninja, just for the early like Moab ceramic popping power stuff, and the sub because it's a really good starting tower and the reactor is really good. So I boost some greens, so he has the monkey boost, and he uh, he leaks quite a few lives, um, and it gets rid of one of his boosts, so he's only got one left um, because I pressured him in the early game. He then goes for a pretty decent sized green rush. And doesn't really do much. It wasn't big enough to cause me any trouble. Although I do get up another Ebba starts for the yellows on the next round. So you probably should have sent um, some more greens there. Maybe layered with pinks. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not a good player like Monkey Lord is. Like Monkey Lord is better than me. I, I admit that. So round nine, he's got a plantation up. Uh, he's only 70 behind, maybe even 50 behind in eco, which I found really surprising because he's got the added plantation as well. And the ice tower, funnily enough, actually hurts, it, it pops all the leads. Don't know why I said hurts right there. Uh, but anyway, I've got my reactor up and my sub. Uh, he's getting his sub up and he's got the uh, ever starts. So we're all sorted for round 13 through to round 15 where we have to get an extra ever starts up or maybe a double shot for me because I got the ninja to deal with the ceramics. Now I'm just going to slow down when it gets to round 15 just in case one of us sends a rush. Uh, actually he's got more eco than me plus a plantation though I'm up in boosts. So I send a ceramic layered with the pinks and yeah he, he demolishes it completely which is <laughs> nice I guess. I say, I say nice because I didn't think he'd deal with it that well. Uh, you know, as well as he did. So now I'm 100 up in eco, which is nice. Um, he goes for the Republic. So he's got like five to 6,000 stored up right there. He also spams uh, some 0, zero subs, uh, just in case I send a mob, uh, which I don't. He doesn't send a mob as well, because as you can see, I'm saving up for the Bunjutsu Ninja, which I get, which probably defends a Moab without a boost. So it gets really, really interesting on round 20, uh, which is BFB time. Now this is what it all comes down to. He's got the ice tower to slow it down, but I've got the boats, which I haven't showed yet. So if he sends a BFB, then I can just pull it, but I, I can't remember if he does. Right, so, round 20. He sends he sends a BFB straight away. I send a BFB a tiny bit afterwards. So uh, this is where <laughs> it gets funny. So I, I just put the boat out, and I just demolished the rush, because uh, he didn't know I had boats. He actually thought this was my fourth tower, but it wasn't. So yeah, I sell some towers, get the boats, pull up, and absolutely demolish it. Put his eco, he sold all his farms to get all those subs. And will he defend? He gets the ice uh, up, so the ice ability was really useful. And he actually, wait, 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 no, he leaks. 
So he's got 70 lives. He literally leaks the exact same number of lives he needed to leak, as you can see there. So it was so close, literally. But I probably would have won anyway, because I had the boat. But yeah, so I hope you enjoyed that best of three. Sorry I had to do it on Battles TV. I'm sorry if it spoiled it by looking at the times on the video and stuff. But yeah, I really hope you enjoyed. Uh, as I said, I'll link Monkey Lord's channel in the description. And yeah, see ya.